Hello and welcome to the multi-cloud technical series. In this video number one, I'm going to backup cloud instances from different public clouds, for example AWS, Azure and IBM Cloud, right from single application VM Backup and Replication 9.5 Update 3. I've just finished software installation and navigating through cloud consoles to show you those instances. They are all running Windows operating system and accessible from Veeam server. I am going to Inventory tab and creating a new protection group so I can combine those cloud instances together. I am selecting individual computer scope and then manually adding each instance providing its IP address and corresponding administrative credentials so later Veeam can access the instance. I am leaving rescan options by default and making sure that install backup agent automatically option is selected. After a couple of seconds, the settings are saved and new multi-cloud protection group is created, so I can run the actual discovery process now. As the cloud instances are being discovered, Veeam automatically installing a backup agent on each of those. After this operation, I can check the list of newly added instances. Now I am switching to backup infrastructure pane and go in to add a backup repository to the console. For this purpose, I'm using the same backup server and its 100 gig G drive previously attached and presented to the system. Repository creation is easy and it doesn't take too much time. In just a couple of seconds, new repository is added to the console and now I can go ahead and create an actual backup job for cloud instances. I'm selecting a backup job for Windows computers specifying a type, a mode and the name for the backup job. After that, adding the whole protection group as a backup source. I'm selecting to backup an entire instance and pointing the job to the previously created backup repository. After that, I'm making sure that the application aware processing option is enabled and then starting the backup job. For demonstration purposes, I had to speed up the backup process. Once the job has finished successfully, I can go to the backups on a disk and find new recovery points created. If I right-click on any of those, I can find all available recovery options and perform actual recovery if I need. That's it for now. Stay tuned for other multi-cloud theme videos. Bye-bye!